All right, Dick Rochford here with some weather to the north. And we've elected to uh, continue uh, eastbound to clear this weather here. So that's a strategic move. And we're using a strategic tool to accomplish that. But the Mark 1 eyeballs and the weather radar all agree that that's a good idea. So that's what we're doing. For Tango, Golf 8 miles northeast, Chet to feed right, Chet to maintain 1,600 until established or clear for the R and have approach runway 9 or you can contact International Channel 118.2. Once we get. Chet, maintain 1,600 until established. Marathon. We're cleared back to uh, our flight plan route, which doesn't look so swift anyway, but we'll negotiate that as we get a little closer. Marathon. It's looking like direct Marcy will work from Marathon. 414 Kilo So at some point we'll want to negotiate that. 7 Romeo Papa, traffic about uh, 5 miles southeast of you, out to in case 2200 type unknown. 7 Romeo Papa, thank you. I'm sorry, he was about 5 miles southwest of you. He's about, uh, I don't know, you're 5 o'clock? Oh, okay. Is he overtaking us? Looks like he is a little bit. He's dropped out of nowhere. Oh, okay. Thanks. Yeah. 014 Kilo, Sierra, just come from your uh, three miles northeast international, 900 feet in the climb 2000. That's correct. 014 Kilo, Sierra. 014 Kilo, Sierra, radar contact climb, mean team 12000. So just as a refresher, next rat is a strategic tool, and that's how we're using it. So the plan is to go to Marathon and then make a left turn direct to Marcy, which is over here. Let's see if we can't negotiate that change. And then the radar here will confirm uh, or deny that that's useful. Now one limitation of the radar, no matter how good it is, is that it, it can only show what's in front of you more or less yeah, within its field of view. So sometimes it's necessary to ask ATC for a turn, a temporary turn, uh, before you accept the clearance. And that's important because once you accept the clearance, uh, there may be a delay in getting a change. Uh, could I be 18 or flight level 200? We said 13. How about 13, yeah. Uh, can I negotiate uh, 13 as a final, please? That'll be, that'll be an even out to you. You want 14 or 12? 14. Yeah, 14 would be good. Number 7, Romeo Pop, maintain 1 4,000. One four thousand. Thanks for nine Romeo Pop. Army four one four. I'm not Sierra, sure what he's thinking of because we're going east and 000. it should be an odd altitude. He's four talking about the route, Sierra, though. Uh, okay. Areas of moderate to extreme precipitation. So we've got, got lots of rain showers in the air today. This is Dick Rochefort aboard nine one seven Romeo Papa. Thank you very much, four four Kilo. Piper M three fifty G one thousand NXI equipped, beautiful airplane. And th there aren't too many aircraft that are capable of dealing with this weather. So if you got an older Malibu with a weather scout or in-op weather scout, don't do this. Uh, the next ride is a strategic tool. I can't say that often enough. Every year, some hapless PA-46 pilot wanders into thunderstorms. And uh, it's, it's, it's tragic. It's not necessary. So if you're not willing and able to trust the radar, then skip the flight. Don't try to do this with NEXRAD. I say this as you're looking at NEXRAD, but this is a strategic tool. So our destination today is Orlando, and uh, as soon as we got lined up with the runway, both the radar and the NEXRAD corroborated, told us that we need to go to Marathon before we can make our turn safely. So we negotiated that and then renegotiated uh, to remove some of the waypoints that took us back through the weather we were just avoiding. And now here we are uh, on our way to Marathon. Now that we're on our way to Marathon doesn't mean that we don't have any other issues. So we have some weather here, some weather here. But this is all doable with radar. Uh, some of this, trying to go through the middle of that, or through the middle of this, would not be doable. That's why we elected to go to Marathon.
Uh, at least I think it would be doable based on this first analysis. Haven't done that. Now let's let's roll over to the radar and see what the radar says. And as you might expect, the radar is clear. We probably won't see much on this until we make the turn. Uh, might be some weather creeping in here. We can check on that if you like. So we'll turn on the bearing pointer. And then slew the bearing pointer with the slew lever knob. And then change to the vertical profile. And now if this picture shows it taller at the top than at the bottom, that's water. And that's by definition water. That's how you see it with this vertical profile. So the secret sauce. Romeo, Papa, when the weather does permit you, you can proceed direct Lee County. Direct Lee County when able, 7 Romeo, Papa. All right, so we'll check that in a second. So that's weather. That's something we don't want to go through. Okay, 414 Kilo Sierra, when weather permits you, I have a route for you. That's 20 way. miles away, 18 miles now. So we just got permission to turn. So we definitely don't want to go more than 15 miles in this direction. So let's see if we can make the turn. So set yourself up direct to the next fix. Let's go to flight plan and RSW and direct down or enter. Let's see which way that needle points when we do that. All right, that's a turn to the north. Oh, that's all right, that's all right. Go, go. That's all right. Let's I'll start the turn, but... No, uh, I'd, I'd like you to go direct. Oh, okay. uh, uh, yeah. because uh, that's what we said we would do. Leave that alone and stay with me now on the weather, because this, this is really important. All right, so you see what that's doing for us. Now let's go to the radar. I am showing some extreme precipitation here, 12 and 1 o'clock at about uh, four and a half miles. And let's see how it looks. Uh, we see it four and four kilos here. We're going to go on out to 40 miles and, and plug down a little bit. All right, so you see, you see what we got coming in front of us here. Now looking out the window, that looks kind of nasty. But... Uh, you know, we didn't make the turn too soon because we had 15 miles in front of us. We had other weather. We can go over this, and I'm guessing over this and over that, but if that's not the case, then we make a 20 left and then go on about our merry way. You okay with that? I am. Dick Rochford flying safely. Train off it.